What's going on everybody? Jem Min here with another statue unboxing and review. This time we have a dual review to do. We have both Thor and Silver Surfer from Diamond Select. And what's so cool about these is that they companion together to recreate the cover of Silver Surfer issue 4. Before we jump into the unboxing, make sure to hit that subscribe. Make sure to hit the notification bell so you don't miss a video. We're doing a giveaway once we hit our next subscriber milestone of 150k. And we're giving away a Deja Thoris premium format by Sideshow. Stick around to the end of the video, I'll give you more details on that. With that out the way, let's go ahead and start with unboxing Thor. Alright, and here we have the art box. You can see they have a picture of the statue on all sides. Pretty sleek looking box with the Thor logo. Of course, we have the styrofoam underneath and the certificate of authenticity. This one's actually number 1531 out of 3000 and sculpted by Claiborne Moore. Alright, so it's just taped around the middle. We'll use the box cutter. As always, let's get this thing open. Alright, so there's Thor on the base. Uh, this is all one piece, and there are a ton of pieces of styrofoam to protect this piece, uh, which I'm thankful for. You don't want any of the cape to snap or anything like that, so let's go ahead and remove the plastic. Thor trapped in the plastic trying to break free air it out a little bit and uh, make sure we don't chip any of the wings on this helmet or anything like that they have a bunch of like blocks of styrofoam in individual plastic kind of tucked in all these nooks and crannies like you see here right away I'm digging the top of the base it looks just like the cover of the comic on of Silver Surfer issue 4 uh, with that distinct rainbow look all right and I think this is the last Oh, there's two more pieces right here on the bottom. All right, and then we have, uh, actually, now there's two more. They had a lot of packaging in this one. All right, so here we go. Time to take a look at Thor. All right, so I think it looks great, man. A nice little compact diorama. I love the cape swooping through his leg, going to the front of it. Uh, let's take a look at the bottom really quick. So like I said, 1531 out of 3,000. I like how you have like the Asgard scene in the background. You can see the back of it there. A lot of folds in the cape. Molnir, of course. Thor cocked back. Let's get him on the turntable real quick. Yeah, he looks good. Just that arm outstretched, ready to swing on Silver Surfer, who will be incoming once we set up this diorama. Classy base. You have that all black bottom. Then you have like that wood look, that little border between the bottom of the base and the rainbow bridge. So that looks cool and then again you get you get Asgard in the distance there so you see the back of it there and let's take a look at Molnir real quick nice and zoomed in so he's got it outstretched he's holding it by the leather strap it's fully extended and ready to swing onto Norin Rad and here's just a close-up of Thor now his feathers do look a little close together if you look head on, but from the side it looks perfect. So there's Thor, you got his hair, his costume, looking great. Alright, before we unbox Silver Surfer, a quick word from our sponsor. SLHLA.com has exclusive variants with new drops every Tuesday and Thursday with amazing artwork. You can save 10% off any item in the store anytime you shop there by using the code GEMMINT at checkout. And that goes for their sister site, that's SpidermanBooth.com as well. They have $30 mystery boxes where you're guaranteed 5 comics of retail value. One lucky box is going to include the GP, the giveaway prize, which is a key issue that'll be in each round. Use that same code GEMMINT to save that same 10% every time you shop there. All right, here goes the box for Silver Surfer. It's what you would expect. It has the Silver Surfer logo, but on the back here, it shows that this is part of a diorama. So I think that's really cool. And it's the first time I'm really noticing Diamond Select doing something like this. I mean, they've done companion pieces. I'm thinking like Cable and Deadpool with Domino, but uh, this one meant to recreate a comic book cover. I think that's really, uh, really a good idea. And again, we have the styrofoam with the COA. This one is number 665 out of 3000, also sculpted by Claiborne Moore, hand sculpted to be exact. All right, so then again, you can see the edition number. You got the Marvel emblem here. Let's go ahead and get that box cutter. Get this bad boy open. And uh, this one's two pieces. So this one, you have the base and you have Surfer. Let's go ahead and grab the base first, get the plastic off. 
Wow, I really like the effect that they did on this base, man. It looks like it's the comic book cover ripped off and wrapped around this base to give it the illusion of space. So it looks like he's in midair flying. I really like that touch. That looks great. Bottom of the base as usual. That looks really good. Very classy. And right, now let's take a look at Surfer. So he's all one piece. You can see the keyhole with the magnet there. And wow, I really am digging how he's looking here, man. I like that paint job. It's a, a dull silver, but it's got shine to it. He's outstretched the same pose from the cover. He has all the sculpted in muscle details. The traditional board. He looks great, man. All right, let's put him together and get him on the turntable. All right, there we go. So now he's on the base. You can see how that design, that looks awesome, man. Super 60s style. It looks great. The color contrast from the dark black and the blue with the shiny silver surfer on top, suspended in air, aiming downward. That looks great. Got the cosmic LEDs in the background. Let's take a close up of surfer really quick before we pair these guys together, man. Wow, that looks great. The detail, the eyeliner that Silver Surfer has in the 60s especially looks awesome. The board looks great. But let's get these guys on the table together. Wow, awesome, guys. So there you go. The epic cover, the iconic Silver Surfer 4 recreated in three-dimensional statue form. Thor vs. Surfer, who will win? You got to let me know in the comments below. Like I said, we're doing a giveaway once we hit that next subscriber milestone of 150K. All you got to do is be subscribed, leave a like, and comment on this video. And once we hit the 150,000, we'll go live the following Sunday, pick a random video where I promoted the giveaway, and use a random YouTube comment generator to draw a worldwide winner. As always, I appreciate you guys watching. Uh, make sure to check out my other statue unboxing and reviews, and stay minty fresh. Peace.